What's going on YouTube? Effect Records here. This is just a overview of what I've done so far to get where I'm at because I'm hoping to install the turbo this week um, with the, taking off the old manifold, putting the new one on and stuff like that. So this is basically just a video right before I do that to just in case if I missed anything to basically go over the entire process or what I did to get here. So, um, so as you see here, I got the Evo manifold right here which uh, i had to get this uh evo manifold to t3 t4 turbo adapter which then i got a wastegate um adapter on that and i attached the wastegate to the one side and then the turbocharger to the other side now to get all of these to actually line up because all of these are threaded and since they're not exactly the same uh they're the same thread but they're not the same um, like they're not in sync with each other kind of thing so what I had to do is I had to drill out these threads in this wastegate and then thread it in here and then it lined up pretty good so um, that's what I had to do to get done with that then I got the wastegate right here turbo um, the only thing I'm waiting in for now is the coupling for the uh, for the coupling right here the two inch to 2.5 inch coupling to go from this smaller pipe to the bigger pipe that I got. Uh, I have a three inch to two and a half inch coupling for this, um, for the intake side of the compressor. And then I just got this welded yesterday. So uh, this is basically the wastegate and the down pipe that I cut and here's the other piece that I that I cut. Now I'm gonna try to make this go downwards. The reason why I cut it is because when it uh, was sitting up like that, it was angled towards the engine and that was no bueno. That was not gonna happen like that. So I had to fix it and then that's what I came up with. So I'm gonna cut this a little bit more and then try to get this welded also and go straight down and then hopefully connect into my exhaust. So that's what I'm doing with that. Um, I ordered me a manifold gasket from AutoZone. It said it should be in here today, so I'm gonna pick that up during my lunch break from work. And then I got some gaskets over there with some bolts and stuff like that. So um, this is basically the turbo. I just used uh, four long ass bolts all the way around that seals it together with some big ass bolts that seals the uh, actual adapter flange to the manifold itself. If you look up here, and I got those bolts in it. So that's what I got going for the turbo side. So let's go ahead and hop out to my Lancer and I'll show you what I got going on that with the battery in the trunk and the engine bay and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and get out to my Lancer. Okay, so now we're at my Lancer. Let's go ahead and pop the hood. Okay, so this is what I got for the engine bay mods right before I uh, finish it. So as you see, I got my newly throttle body pipe that goes straight from a three inch to a two and a half to this little curve to another two and a half to three inch to fit my mass airflow sensor. But then the other side will allow it allowed me to use just a regular two and a half inch coupling and then it goes to my blow-off valve and then down to my intercooler all the way around and then it comes up here and then my air filter so that's basically how i routed it so far now i'm hoping to when i actually put the turbo in i'm hoping to just remove this uh this uh, strut bar right here and just hopefully i have enough room to just slide it down that little gap so that's what I'm banking on because I really don't want to take the turbo off the manifold because it was a bitch just to get it on with all the fucking uh, long ass bolts that I had to use and stuff like that. So hopefully it'll slide down nice and easy once I get this old manifold off with the exhaust and stuff like that. Um, so like I said, this is my first turbo build myself so I'm new to everything I'm learning as I go. But for the most part I know how they work. I took auto technology class. Uh, so I know a decent amount, but like I said, these problems are just issues that I got to figure out. My first turbo build, I'm a Lancer, and then this 
is going to be my bracket. It's not really doing much right now, but it's in there. And it's gonna basically hold this up like this. And that's how I plan it for that. So yeah, that's basically the engine bay, what I got. Also got an oil um, cooler in there as well. Hooked it to my sandwich lines, which is going to eventually go to my turbo. So I got to go to this one shop here in town to get some lines and fittings for all that. So let's go ahead and take a look at my trunk, though. I plan on putting hardwood flooring on it like I did my 03 Lancer. But this is the battery that I stuck in the trunk. Um, because the piping was where the battery that I first relocated it was. And then if I can pop this clip off. There it is. There's one anyway. There we go. So that's what I got for that. Because where the battery used to be stock in this car is now where pipes are. And where the battery I relocated the first time is there's pipes there. So there's pipes in both locations. This is just going to make it easier. Um, so I just basically got some black wire um, that I got from Lowe's, like house wire with thick uh, ass cables uh, or strands. And then it runs all the way to the where the battery used to hook up at. And then I got my amp wire tied to my amp. And then I got the ground wire just hooked up to a bolt that's here in my trunk. So now this is going to be hardwood flooring in here soon. Uh, but yeah, that's basically what I got so far for the turbo. So stay tuned. So either I'm hoping to do it this week. I'm not entirely sure if I want to put the video on this week or next week. Because I got a lot of videos to edit still that we've been working on. But... Uh, here in a couple weeks, week or whatever. Like I said, I'm hoping to do it tomorrow, but hopefully we'll get it done for you guys and get the video out because I'm really excited. I'm really stoked. I think this is gonna pump my level up. So yeah, stay tuned for more videos. So with that being said, if you like this video, please comment, rate, and subscribe. All right, peace.